actually had been worked over and refiberglassed. It was that rough. And I've seen several in town that are, you know, their seams are pulling apart like this. So this one has been worked over before I even got to it, and it was primed the prim about a year and a half ago, but the primer started going. So when I got it here, it had a hairline crack. It's a mold, you know, a fiberglass mold of sorts, and it had a hairline crack running the full length of the dolphin, which meant it's just gonna pull apart even more over time. So I routed it with a Dremel, and then did West System, which is fiberglass, tough stuff. Did it all over here. I worked it over for a week before I applied any paint whatsoever. Sanded the tar out of it, and then uh, Big, whoa, Big John here sprayed the background, the primer, and then I hand brushed this purple on two coats. Came out real nice with my sign brushes with the long hair that makes it go on smooth. And then let that dry and then had a grease pencil and that this is where light layout comes in. You know, I had a, a printout. This was a puzzle mm. that you could buy on the internet, this design. Mm. The, the woman, uh, Catherine Cook, is Catherine and Bill Cook are the owners of this. She emailed me the uh, link to the website that sells these puzzles. So I pulled it up and it was, it was a puzzle and she wanted it like that and I saw the intricate work on that. I said, oh, that's gonna take some doing, you know? So anyway, I had that picture to look at and just laid it out with my grease pencil, got things to close enough proportion and just, mix you know mix my colors to match that artwork you know lay out color mixing you are halfway there and just started lobbing colors on there these are um ronin sign industry lettering paints they're built for outdoor signs billboards and then this gets a double coat of a U, a really hot rat uv protected clear coat it's going to be sprayed on about tuesday um two coats of that and that should you know and, and that's uh, a real special outdoor uv protected clear coat so that should that should help for the longevity thing and plus things like you know i know black fades real fast so i double coated the black because it's out in sun, full on, all day, every day.